Utah weather is a bit out of your range. <laughs> yeah, it's a little bit further. We can look ahead to Tuesday with you. What do we got on deck? Oh man, just a stretch of weather that is just so inviting here. Yeah. It's going to be nice outside. It's going to be sunny outside. It's going to be dry outside. It's incredible out right now. Oh, it sure is. Yeah, you mentioned earlier, it kind of feels like summer a little bit. You know, temperatures not reaching 80s and 90s, but Boy, does it feel really nice outside. It looks nice outside too. If you have any plans, go for that bike ride or that run. Temperatures are in the upper 60s, near 70 degrees right now. Usually our average is about 65, so we're a little bit above that, and we're going to stay that way as we go through the week. Camas, beautiful view there. Monmouth at 71. I was checking out some of the changing leaves there on some of the trees. And it's just beautiful weather. We have high pressure here, but there is some action actually going on uh, just to the north of Utah. Moab looks OK. Denver, yeah, about the same, but snow just to the north and the cooler air is there. You can see the reds and the oranges showing nice warm fall weather. Temperatures actually about 70 degrees uh, across most of Oregon, at least west of the Cascades, but just a couple states away, 40s and 50s, more like winter. All right, it's 69 degrees right now in Hillsboro, 70 for Beaverton as well as Tiger. If you're going to be out here the next couple of hours, again, just perfect weather. 68 for Gresham and a pair of sixes coming out of Camas. And this weather is going to continue, if you haven't heard me say it. And on top of it, no rain. I have no rain in the forecast all week. Again, we need the rain, but uh, we'll take this nice weather. Uh, on the side of everything, with that cold air not too far away uh, and high pressure in place, we do have some windy conditions kind of developing. The strongest of that wind is going to be parts of the gorge uh, tomorrow and into Monday. And if you saw there, uh, average uh, clear days for October, about five. Yeah, we're going to have a lot more than that this month. Okay, current wind speed, we have about 9 miles per hour there along the coast running out of the east, really helping those temperatures warm up there. 17 miles per hour coming out of Salem, about 10 miles per hour here in Portland, and over to areas like Bend and Madras, about 10 to 15 miles per hour. Here's our wind gust forecast as we go into tomorrow morning. Watch what happens. Our wind gust goes from maybe about 10 to 15 miles per hour upwards to about 25, and locations in the gorge will start to pick up too, but it looks like just to the west of the Cascades is going to be the strongest wind heading into tomorrow morning. So You'll probably hear it, and if you're going to be out tomorrow, uh, you're going to feel it a little bit too. Again, heading into the afternoon hours and evening hours, looks like we keep that wind gust about 20 to 25 miles per hour there. All right, short term forecast, really not much rain. Again, it is going to be off to the east. We're going to stay dry. Yeah, the time is ticking here. Doesn't look like there's a lot of changes because there really isn't going to be with that high pressure in place, really solidifying our forecast for the next few days. Okay, I do want to tell you though, uh, with the clear conditions, our temperatures are going to drop overnight uh, for mainly east of the Cascade. So there is this freeze warning in place till Sunday at 9 a.m. Goes uh, in effect, I think about 2 a.m. there. And watch out for those temperatures dropping down to the 20s again. Sensitive vegetation out there, bring it inside or cover it if you can. And if you're going to be out early doing yard work, it's going to get cold out there. Temperatures likely in the mid 20s to the lower 30s. Pendleton, I have about 31 degrees. Look at that burns into the teens, so very cold off to the east there. We'll drop down to about the upper 40s for us in Portland, 43 degrees there for Salem. Okay, for the forecast tomorrow, upper 60s, some mid 70s, some lower 70s out there too. A lot of sunshine for you folks. East breeze uh, about 10 to 15 miles per hour. We'll be right around the same tomorrow, so if you enjoyed today, again, Carbon copy again uh, for our forecast tomorrow. 62 degrees for Madras, Bend about 58. And through the gorge, temperatures in the upper 60s, government camp at 51 degrees. Trevor, as I mentioned, I have no rain in the forecast. Yeesh. Pleasant weather all the way through, oh, man. even the mid 70s come Tuesday and Wednesday. If you got a problem with that seven day forecast, God help you. Yeah, I, don't, I don't know what to do. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that is unbelievable. It's just Jesse. nice. Yeah, I'm just waiting for the changes, and it looks like the next five, seven days, yeah. not much. Wonderful. Yeah. Fantastic. Thank you.